Hi everyone, today's video we'll see how we can create this timesheet. So this sheet covers the employee moment details, um, uh, morning and afternoon shift with time in and time out. So uh, it calculates every day's uh, time and, and the total monthly working hours. You can download the template from the description. Hi friends, once again welcome to the Clip for Knowledge. I uh, hope you are enjoying our videos. Please do subscribe and support and share with your friends. Now let's create the um, template. For that, I'm, I'm updating the details. Time card. I'm mentioning as time card the heading. Um, so I'm just enlarging it. Okay. Now I'll I'll update the remaining fields. So I'm updating the employee name here. Right. So your employee name will be highlighted here. I'm putting as yellow. Okay. So this will be adjusted in the later stage. Okay. Now I'm updating the time in um, so this is in the format of hh colon mm so hours and minutes spaces and then uh, i'm updating time out okay so this is also in the hh and mm format okay so uh, this is the um, morning time uh, time in and time out so i'm copying and pasting into the afternoon time on time in and time out the same way so i'm inserting another column here right to update the um, morning shift and afternoon i'm just removing the yellow which is it's carried forward from the above row okay i removed it now let's uh, uh, put update the morning shift here and also uh, merge it uh, to make the cell and also put here as uh, afternoon shift now merge and adjust uh, now let's uh, put some colors to it and um, I'm here track dust wrapping it so that um, it's in the right format now I'm updating total working hours one thing which you need to note while entering a time in the Excel that it should be in the proper format. So you need to do an HH uh, colon uh, MM format. That is hours colon MM. So if you put a number instead of uh, this format in, in Excel, really doesn't a uh, number instead of time. So it should be properly uh, mentioned. Uh, the HH hour first and then colon and then give the minute after that right this is very important also you can change the time format right by right clicking and then go to the format cells and uh, updating it now i'm just color coding it uh, putting it to blue and white right so which is the standard format which i use for my videos right so let's uh, update the, the other cells as well uh, putting the table now okay uh, colors like uh, blue and white again okay now i'll just uh, first column uh, I'm, I'm just oh, i don't want the number i'll change it to date because we are looking at the overall months um, um, uh, time sheet so i'm updating date right so i'll, I'll put the date to first april okay right so um so this is not in the formats so first here month comes first so i need to change it to um zero four and one after that right so i'm, I'm just changing to four uh, and this is this this is uh, a fourth uh, month first day so i'm just dragging and copying remaining fields now so i have the time here the morning shift and afternoon shift uh, now i need to calculate the total working hours for that particular day so use the formula equal to and and open the bracket select timeout minus time in uh, close the bracket plus uh, and then next uh, shift so open the bracket uh, again then uh, timeout minus time in so uh, end up you get the uh, total working hours for that particular day so i'm just uh, copying and pasting in the remaining remaining field so that i can um, use it into the remaining uh, days okay so uh, for the ease of purpose i just copying and pasting into all the remaining cells so it's automatically calculated the total working hours for each day so uh, i'll do it for the entire months 
uh, and uh, formatted by change any time uh, it's automatically capture the total working hours and you can see it's already reflected here right it's all are in the time format okay so I'm just adding the remaining days in the month uh, till 30th of April um, just um, I'm putting the table Uh, and copying pasting the same dates in all the feeds this you can use it uh, based on your <coughs> requirements I'm sorry for that I'm copying and pasting the formula in the, all the remaining fields so you get the um, entire months uh, uh, working hours so uh, now I need to calculate the total working hours for the entire month uh, here uh, so the, the trick is that the time format into need to be in proper way so i'm using uh, some basic sum formula and i'm dragging and selecting the entire months working hours okay total working hours and then close the bracket you get the total but it's not in the right format so you need to go to format cells and go down here and select this bracket edge always select this to calculate in custom okay just end up you get the total uh, working hours for the entire month so formatting is very important and and while while doing while dealing with time right excel didn't don't recognize uh, the time and the and the number uh, when you are um, providing a details or enter a number into the excel thank you so much for watching see you in the next video i hope this you enjoy this video you can download the template from the description and also please do subscribe my channel and support let me know your comment in the comment box. Thank you so much. See you in the next video.